Hi, welcome to the demo of Clasis RP Genie. Today, we are going to demonstrate the activity called Wait for Element Vanish. This activity is used to wait for a specified UI element to disappear from the screen. To demo this, we are going to open a generic website. Here, we are going to select an element from the carousal and use the wait for element vanish activity to trigger when the element is disappeared from the site. Now, let's go back to the RPG Studio and search for the wait for element vanish activity. We can now drag the activity to the sequence. Now, let's select the element from the website using the selector property. In the select window pop-up, we will choose the Chrome browser window and search for the element in the website using the selector. Once the element is highlighted, we can perform a click to capture the element. On the right side of the selector, you can see the properties section. We can change these properties if you like. I'm gonna keep this as default for now and click on OK. We can see that the element is added to the wait for element vanish activity. Now, we can add a message box to the sequence by dragging the message box activity. Let's add a message in the message box. Finally, let's run the automation now by clicking on the play button. We can disappear the element by sliding to the right of the carousal and as you can see, the message box have appeared on the screen since the element is vanished. Let's go back to the RP Genie Studio and look at the properties of this activity, mainly for the timeout property. Timeout occurs when a predefined interval of time passed without a certain event occurring and the default value for this property is 30 seconds. To demonstrate this, we can change the value to 3 seconds for now. When the timeout occurs, the sequence is navigated to the error section. Here, we need to add an error variable to capture the error message received and also an error message box to display the error by typing in error variable dot message. Let's run the automation again now. Let's wait for three seconds for the activity to time out. We can now see that the error message is displayed as element not vanish. Thanks for watching. Bye.